morning live here on SABC2. Now, as we continue our focus on Women's Month, today we're tackling a subject that many women still struggle to deal with, their perfect bra size and how this could have an impact on their health. A study published back in 2013 indicates that on average, four out of five women are wearing an ill-fitting bra at this current moment. we joined in the studios this morning by a bra guru, Taryn Palacios. Taryn, good morning to you and welcome to Morning Live. Good morning, Palisa. Thank you so much for having me and hello to all your viewers. Thank you so uh. much for having taken your time out to be here with us, especially as we conclude Women's Month. Yes. Quite a, a serious topic I must indicate, bra fitting. 80%, mm -hmm. um, in fact, you were telling me just before the ad break that it's actually 70% of women are currently wearing in an incorrect bra size. Yes. But how does that come about? Well, it comes about for a lot of reasons. And I mean... You know, we our size changes. So a lot of women don't take into effect that into account that through our years from adolescence up to, you know, mature adulthood, um, our breast size can change up to six times. So yeah. it's quite when you know that then you can understand that it's quite normal to have your bra your mm. breast size mm. change. Mm. And in fact that's why the service exists exactly for that reason because it's about finding out how important important it is and getting it right so that you can have more Do we even know the importance of going for a bra fit? Uh, no, certainly not. It's very new here. Mm -hmm. So a lot of women don't understand the importance of it, but it's so important. I mean, a bra is the one thing that you're wearing all day, you know, wow. and most of us wear our bra and, and uh, all day for 12 hours. And a lot of ladies will say the first thing I want to do is take it off. That's the first thing that I do and when I get home. But that's the sign that yeah. there's something not right. So okay. it's when women are feeling like that or constantly feeling like I'm not sure, I don't know how it feels, I don't know what I feel about this bra, that you really should be investigating mm -hmm. how to get properly fitted. Those are sure signs that you're in the incorrect size or maybe not in the incorrect size, but maybe the incorrect style. Sometimes we're also not open to the fact that there are so many styles of available to you mm. when you choose to go and see like someone like myself who's an expert in it and can actually look at you look at what styles are going to suit you look at what sizes we're going because different styles can also give you a different size so maybe, maybe really Tarana, the question here should mm. be how often should a woman go for a bra fitting yes yeah well i would definitely say these different industry standards suppliers will have different things i think once a year is sufficient once a year um yeah. but obviously you would know yourself so once you come in for the fitting you're also a bit more educated in terms of what you're kind of looking for how your bra should fit mm. so if you noticed any changes or you suddenly gained a cup size or s had lost weight and lost a back mm. size. These are things that warrant a new bra fitting mm. because again, we must understand the importance of it. Um, having the right support. And when we talk about support of a bra, it must be this back band. 90% of your bra's work is this band. Mm -hmm. A lot of us compromise our support by going mm. to bigger back size to avoid, and it's, it's, it's understandable why. We want to look good. We think, oh, we're going to get lumps and bumps, but those all diminish with a good bra and the wash and wear of a bra mm. so we have to understand that 90 percent of your support has to come here so you have to get that right first okay just to improve better back support neck support because women don't even realize that mm. back ache neck ache indigestion indigestion um, as well can can something be that you wouldn't yeah, think of something right? you wouldn't think yeah, of can easily yeah. be caused mm. from an ill-fitting bra now there was this myth i don't know if it's a myth but when growing up you know you'd be told that if you are a size 34 here on the waist automatically you are a size 34 here depending on on, on that alphabet is it really the case it can be for different women generally we do take a measurement around here and you often okay. are very a lot of women are a back or two back sizes are smaller when they come to me and it is because it's you're much smaller here than sometimes you are in the rest of your yeah. body mm. i would say for some women Women, it can be the case. Yeah. Not, I get some women who maybe wear a 36 size, but they're actually wearing yeah. a 34 bra yeah. or even sometimes 32. All right. Now, you were actually telling me that a proper bra fitting mm -hmm. is when you actually take off you know, the clothes that you're wearing. Yes. But in most cases, when you go to the retail stores for a bra fitting, they just somehow fit while you, you have your, yes. your, your clothes on. Well, so which is the correct way of doing it? The correct it? way, if you're getting fitted, is mm -hmm. the correct way is you are fitted with your bra on. So, and that's, that we, we always try and say you wear your best fitting bras mm -hmm. to make sure that you're all in. That just gives us a better indication. But the best thing is you want to be fitted against your skin and underneath this bra. We do a measurement around your body here. That's to give us your back size. So, if obviously, if you've got layers on, it's going to give us an incorrect oh, size. Yeah. So, that's why it's really important to get it against, you know, against the bra. And that's how we do it and at, at our studio. sometimes you find straps sliding off your shoulders. Yes. But that's a topic for another day. Thank you yes. so much for your time, It's Tarek. a pleasure. You're so welcome. Thank you so much. <laughs> There you have it. That was Taryn Palacios, the bra guru, talking to us about the importance of choosing the correct bra size and the impact to women's health. Quite an interesting one there, Leanne, huh?
Ja, it's, it, Palessa.